Hey everyone, welcome to Heavy Metal Guns. Today out on the range, we have a cool little pistol that we're going to be shooting on loan from my buddy Hootie Hoo. Big thanks to him. And he also gave me some ammo. I mean, you can't beat that, right? Well, what we got here is the uh, High Point Model JHP. This one is in 10 millimeter. Yeah, man. Check it out. Got your rail. Yeah, you can hang your chandelier, a Nova, whatever you want to put on there. Threaded barrel for those of y'all with the shh cams. Put that on there. I mean, these high points, yes, I know. They are very, very big and heavy. But they function and they're accurate. And I love the sights on them. My eyes can pick up them colors just fantastic, and I don't have no issue with these pistols, as well as their carbines. Uh, I think I've had or shot about every high point there is out there so far, and all of them run good. Well, we're going to see how this one runs today. And I have some uh, Remington. Uh, those rice rocking. Yeah, make some more noise during my video. Thank you. All right, I have some Remington 180 grain full metal jackets that we're going to be shooting out of this thing. As y'all know, this stuff is like that flat nose uh, full metal jacket. Let's get us some ears on. And yes, we do have a shaving cream. If it won't kill a shaving cream, then it's worthless. Because someday we'll probably be invaded by shaving creams and we'll need this knowledge. Let's go out here. Uh, let's start at 10. And we need to wake up Kenny this morning. I haven't shot him yet today. And I need to get used to this uh, gun again. Well, let's see if I can still shoot it. I don't know where I'm hitting. Going out there to 20 yards. Get a better idea of my point of aim. Oh yeah, hi Kenny. Yeah, I'm mad dead in the chest on that one. Bet that hurt, Kenny. I loaded this thing up, full mag with 10 rounds. Let's go back out there to 20. <coughs> Excuse me. So we get that round plate to the right. Yes, we can. Now 45 at the big target. Yes, yeah, see that green light flashing? It tells us we hit it. I like that. I wish I had that on every one of them far targets out there. It's pretty neat. Man, this thing is running like a charm. But, will it kill a shaving cream? Just, we just got to know, right? Got the green one right up here. You've got to be kidding me. Every time I shot, the shaving cream moved. I had this problem in another video I did this morning. And it just seems like the targets are trying to avoid the ammo now. They're getting smart. It's all that AI stuff I would assume. But let's... uh. Let's see if we can get this bad boy while he's trying to move on us and put him out of his misery. You've got to be kidding me. You see him jump on the ground trying to hide from us? Well, this is just blowing my mind. Let's go put him back up. Yeah, sometimes talking to your targets helps. You just, I mean, you just got to tell them who the boss is, guys. You can't put up with stuff like that. You shoot a target, it shouldn't move out of the way and make you look bad. 
Most people think that you can't shoot, you can't act. It has been a while since I shot this thing. Yeah, he didn't move that time, did he? Yeah, man. Had to add some extra ammo in there. We are clear. <coughs> yeah, I had to grab a few extra bullets there to uh, get that elusive shaving cream. See what I was talking about? You gotta watch them shaving creams. They're sneaky. And you never know what to expect from them. So try to hit them. Get every one of them if you can. But all jokes aside, yes, we are clear. Mag is empty. I mean, man, the high point, JXP and 10 millimeter. This is a fun shooter. Uh, I believe it's the first time I ever shot this one. I had to get back used to the sights. Trigger's fine. I got no problems with these triggers on the high points. They're not super heavy. There's a, uh, a really good wall they go against, so you know when she's going to click. It's a bit of a weird flat trigger. You do have to get used to that. Sort of wide, but that's pretty cool. Uh, like I say, uh, you know, the grips on them are good. Your hands are wet or whatnot. Let's have got a grip here on the back and the front, so you get a good handhold on that thing. So, yeah. I like it, and it done well for us, and we finally got this shaving cream. Well, everyone, that's going to wrap it up. I do appreciate you watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I had fun shooting it, and that's a big plus. Oh, if y'all would, throw us down some comments. Hit us up on Patreon and or that super thanks. And please, like, share, and subscribe. Again, I appreciate it much. Till the next one, well, that everyone has a fantastic day.